Hello everyone, this is Curtis with We Whack A Lawn Care. Hey, today I'm uh, working on a, what can I see, it's a bid. I don't know uh, if I'm going to accept it or not. But uh, what it is, is uh, as you can see up there, bath. No, it's bed and bath beyond. Uh, that's what I'm working on. Uh, this here property here on the outside, they want to get it, um, get it, uh, you know, taken care of. As I'm looking at this right here, uh, it's not a lot to do. It's just keep this here trimmed up. We're looking at. Let's see. Look at this here on the outside. We'll just mow that portion and you know take care of this here little portion right here. Um, let me see and I'm thinking all the way around this whole property here so looking at you know doing a contract which maintaining this here property so we're looking at I guess you know that portion with the bank that all around you know trim the hedges um, that and let's let's look out of here. So I'm gonna see how far we go. We're walking along over here. So looking at this area right here, trimming this here up, you know, a little bit right here. Uh, let's see. Yeah, this little portion, I guess, right in here. Just take care of that. Now we're gonna keep walking. So, let me see how far this go. Uh, Okay, this here is on the back side. Nah, not taking care of that. Walking around. A little bit of right back over there. Just walking over here. Let's see. I don't see a lot. I mean, you know, taking care of this little grass like that, you can put some weed and grass kill around that. That'll take care of that, you don't have to worry about that. Little bush over here. And this portion right here, little bush. Hey y'all, I'm, I'm over here, it says, uh, looking up there, see the House of Pies restaurant in Baker, huh? I, make, I need to step over there and get me one of them pies today. What y'all think? House of Pie, they put out some good pies. I've had some, man, they real good. Mmm, this food is good too. You kind of hungry. Man, wait a minute, that smell like some... Mm -hmm. what it, it's calling me y'all I don't know I may have to get one of them pies but uh, let's, let's look at this right here uh, I guess you know take care of that portion right there little flowers man it smell good out here that food we're walking back over here Take a look. Little flowers, little bushes. This right here. You know, and this right here. You know.
know, and I guess, you know, keep the hedges up and all. And you know, and I guess over here on this on this side. Huh. Well, I don't know. Well, this is all around. Huh. I'm gonna have to, uh, I'm gonna have to ask them about that bank. They want the bank, it's just gonna be this surrounding perimeter for bath, for bed, bath, and beyond. So, I'm gonna see. Now, this is one, y'all. I'm, uh, I'm finna go back and call the guy on this one. And, uh, See, it's not a lot to do to it, but hey, they just want to get it maintained, keep it up. I think it come out like twice, uh, twice a month for the whole season and do this. Now, this is one. Now, I'm finna go and see about a another one. Okay, check it out. May have to take care of this little area around here. So... It wouldn't take no time to do this. Trim out the hedges and with the bank. But they want to, you know, take care of the whole perimeter of the property here. Yeah, as I was saying, yeah, I'm finna go, I gotta go and meet with a customer. Uh, to give them an estimate for his, uh, doing their lines. A lot of, a lot of times y'all don't see this side of me going out doing all these different bids to do these jobs. Uh, you see me basically in the lawn working, running, and doing a lot of just, you know, traveling here and there and doing all these different lawns. Uh, but I do get up early and I go out and uh, I look at properties and I give a bid on them. Some of them I take and some of them I don't. Some of them, you know, they want a lot of, uh, y'all know that I'm saying. They want a lot of stuff for nothing. I mean, you're not going to make any money out of it, so it's not going to be beneficial. You're wasting a lot of time. Now this, I'll see how it go. But, uh, I think I may take it. I'm, I'm going to see. I'm going to put the bead in today, and I'll see how this here go. But, uh, I got to go, y'all. I got some more to share with y'all. All right. Like, I got to go. I got to go back, pick up the truck, pick up the trailer, get the moors and get in the lines. Stay tuned. Let's go. Okay, everyone, I'm back out here and I'm mowing lawns. I just showed up at lawn that I'm finna take care of. Uh, you know, earlier this morning when I went out and I gave, uh, well, a bid on um, that uh, Bed Bath & Beyond, um, that facility mowing around that whole uh, perimeter there. Uh, I added up, you know, I looked at my mileage and the distance I had to travel to go and do it. And so, uh, you know, I, I put in my bid and, and I uh, I told them 150. And uh, they were like, uh, they were saying like, we're gonna do it weekly, uh, $100 a week, which would be great. I mean, you know, with the areas that you have to cut in that perimeter, it was great. But, 
travel time, route density, it's not great. I'm not going to make any money out of it. I'm going to burn up more than I'm going to make the driveway out there. I mean, do it every week. I mean, uh, true, 100 bucks a week for that. If I, if I lived out in that area nearby, it would be great. But I don't. That's like over 40 some miles to drive way over there. And you got to deal with traffic. And, oh, man, that traffic is bad traveling down those freeways. Oh, it's bad. And it floods over that area. So if it starts raining, it gets bad. I mean, you, you when I say bad, we're talking like four or five hours stuck in traffic, bumper to bumper. And mm-mm, mm-mm. So, I told him, you know, really appreciate it, but no, I, I, I couldn't do it. You know, England at that, I knew it was going to go that way anyway when I beat it there because I had, you know, compensate gas and time and all. But it wasn't that I was telling them no, but, you know, you got to pay more for compensation and time, you know, to drive off out there. And I mean, it ain't that much to it, just the outside area, trim that, do the little break the mulch and trim the hedges and keep the grass away from the building and all and it's a great location but uh nah and, and I get a lot of these and I go and I check them out I mean I get uh automotive shops uh, car dealerships uh let me see where else was it uh some kind of farm facility uh dog resorts I get calls from all kinds, and I go and I check out some of this stuff sometimes, and uh, some of them, you know, might be okay, and some of them not. It's just not convenient, and that's the thing you run into in a lot of gear. There's a lot of opportunities, but you got to be nearby, and even trying to put it in a route, uh, sometimes it's just not beneficial. I mean, that would be the only lawn that I would be taking care of on that side of town no residential no other commercial property that I would be taking care of over there so I'm like nah <laughs> all right y'all let me get out the customer just walked up on me uh, let me let me get out here okay guys I'm back uh, as I was stating earlier I was here talking on the camera and uh, the customer had walked up on me and he went to uh, get set up for uh, doing his lawn on a bi-weekly and um, he was telling me, you know, about his wife it was uh, getting historical about uh, getting the lawn mowed uh, before it uh, it rained. <laughs> I, I get a lot of customers. I don't know what it is when it when it's going to rain, but they want to get the lawn looking good before it rains. Even it can be storming, and they have it on the news. My phone will blow up. Everybody like, oh, can you? You think you're going to be able to get it before uh, the storm get here? I really want to get it all cleaned up and looking good before the storm. I'm like, huh? why? It's going to be all messed up. Tree limbs, branches, and all debris going to be all over the lawn when the storm comes and the wind is going to be blowing. But, I, you know, I, I, I do my best to go over there and help the customer. Whatever they want, they want it looking good. Before the storm gets there, I get it looking good. Then guess what happens after the storm? My phone rings and it's on a Sunday. Curtis, I don't mean to bother you, but... uh. You know, the storm really messed my lawn up, and uh, I was wondering, you know, if you don't mind to come over today and uh, kind of get it back looking good. I, I know you, you had it looking good before the storm came, but the storm has came and left, and it just left my yard in a mess. I got limbs and leaves all over it, and do you think you could come on over and uh, kind of, you know, get it back looking good again? It's gone now. Okay, sure. <laughs> whatever you want, whatever you want. If I can do it, I'll do it. And that, that's kind of where it's been, y'all. I don't know. I mean, I've been doing this for some years, and I mean, it, every time if something bad storm or flood, you know, people say, hey, you know, it's, it's going to be a lot of rain, and I really want to get this lawn done before it rains. And I'm like, uh, okay. And, you know, I'll try to do it. But anyway, y'all, let me get on to this next one because, uh, yeah, this customer is like, hey, I got to get my lawn done. It, it, I can't miss it no more. I got to get it. I'm like, okay. So I'm on my way to go do that one, y'all. Stay tuned. Let me go and get this one done.
All right, Hi, everyone. I uh, I just finished up one, and right now I went by and visited a property to give a customer an estimate. I'm in a new subdivision and uh, little small homes. I don't know what these are. Something like I don't know what these are. These are like condominiums, townhomes, and all. I don't know. I'll give you all a view. It's all a new subdivision here. The other one is a house though, but I turn off the screen and this here was uh, a little neighborhood, little community here. So I'm just uh, up here looking. This is all new. So let me uh, see. Let me turn around. They got the road blocked over there. I can't get through there. Anyway, let me go through the back over here. Yeah, this here is all new. Man, I remember it wasn't number woods back here. So now they got all these new homes. I mean, it's looking it's uh tremendous growth. I mean nothing but new new buildings are being put up, new homes. I'm like, wow. Now I've been out in this area going on over 30 some years and I'm like a tremendous growth over this period. I'm like, wow. Just looking at all of these homes. You no, know, those are over across that fence, those are all new. <sighs> Looking at all of the growth of just new new buildings popping up. I didn't even know all of this here was back here. And I'm like, wow. Huh. Just looking at it. More and more growth. Hmm. Yep. Just looking at that. Man. Wow. See that flickering? Look like it's gonna uh, storm. I know they were talking about that rain coming in. So I didn't shut it down. A lot of new homes are just popping up. Oh man, a tremendous growth. Wow. Well, you know, that's more lawn care contracts. Oh yeah. Hmm. Yeah, now this here is where I, I came in and I gave a, a bid to a customer out in this neighborhood right in here. Uh, it's like this here community is all new. I mean, it didn't take long for them to build these new homes. I mean, wow. Just last year, this was all vacant. There were no homes in here. And all of a sudden, a few months, and I'm like, whoa, everything is just popping up. So, just looking at this, I mean, wow. So it's more and more lawn care opportunities in here. Look at it, wow. Let me get out of here though. I need to get out of here. It's stuff to do. So what I'm talking about guys, the rain came. It's raining now. 
Oh man, look at this. Ah. This is how my weekend going. It's raining now, so looking at about three days of rain. Uh, I don't know how you know how how hard it's gonna rain, but this is this is what I've been getting. Trying to uh, catch up on all the lawns that I have now. I almost, I almost, I almost caught up all of them, but I missed one. <laughs> Just one. And I was right at it, and the rain got me. But uh, it's okay, y'all. Anyway, y'all. I'm finna go. I'm gonna put this camera up for right now and uh, I'm gonna get back with y'all later on. Take care. Bye.